Anime Edit Tutorial and CapCut PC. Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and incredible day. I bring you back with yet another video and in this video we're going to be talking about CapCut PC and how you can make anime style edits in it. So it's very simple, like three steps. You're going to choose a video for yourself. So I'm just going to take any random video. So uh, let's say I'm going to go with... Um, Let's go with any, you know what? I'm going to give you a pictures example, let's say. So we're going to take this, okay? Here is, a, you could say it's a picture, but let's think of it as a video. So you're going to do this. You're going to add your audio, like we're going to drag this over here. You're going to take your audio and you're going to drag it right under here. And once you've done that, all you need to do is you're just going to go on effects. And once you're in effects, over here, you're going to start adding the different, um, like you could say, uh, anime type effects. And for that, all you're going to do is you're going to go on video. And obviously, anime type effects have, the, uh, you know, different distortions in it. So let's go with this one. Let's go with this. We're going to add this into our video. And uh, it, it like takes a second to uh, render it. So here you go. Here's your uh, distortion. You can increase the strength of it like it's going to, you know, be more distorted. You can make it even more distorted if you want to by just changing there. You see it like moves in like that. And uh, then you can also add different filters just to make it look uh, a bit, you know, nicer. So for that, you can go on either retro or mono. And once you do that, there you go. I've added retro and look at that looks very anime related. So, yeah, that's how you make anime style edits on CapCut.